What's the difference between an ACL tear and an ACL rupture? Hey, this is Dr. P. Got a problem with your knee? Ask Dr. P. So I, got, I get asked that question all the time. Oh, is, is my ligament ruptured? Is my ligament torn? Uh, do I have a sprain? Well, the official medical name is a sprain, an injury to a ligament, and ligaments connect bone to bone, and this is a knee right here, and this would be the MCL, the medial collateral ligament. You also have the LCL, the lateral collateral ligament. The MCL is a little more common to tear uh, or get injured than the LCL, but that can as well. Then you have your ACL, the anterior cruciate ligament, which this one is torn right here, uh, and then the PCL right here. So if we're talking about um, a rupture, it's, that's kind of a generic term, but to me, when I hear rupture, that means it's completely torn. I mean, that's just kind of anecdotal. I don't really use the term rupture. Tear is also a generic term. What does tear mean? Tear could be a little microscopic tears. Tear could be a partial tear or stretched, like you see a plastic, you know, piece of plastic stretch, or a tear can be 100% torn. So we like to call them sprains. So you have a grade one sprain, that's usually just very microscopic or very minimal, no laxity, no instability, everything's still attached. Grade two is a partial tear, so it might be partially torn, um, or it might be just stretched out um, significantly. And then grade three sprain is um, a complete tear. So notice I'm using tear and sprain uh, together, but grade one, grade two, grade three, rupture is kind of a generic term, and I think most people use that just when it's completely torn, like blown apart. <laughs> so I, uh, that's use the word sprain, and that's actually the best way to, to talk about ligaments.